Hey everyone, uh, today we have a short explanation on a concept known as the ablative of respect, which is sometimes called the ablative of specification. Okay, and you can find the explanation for this in your book on page 136. Okay, so the ablative of respect is to denote in respect to what? In respect to something. So in English, we would say that, oh, uh, she's really good at tennis. Right? She's good in respect to, to playing tennis. Or um, he uh, is uh, proficient in writing. He's proficient in respect to writing. Uh, there are a couple of key words in Latin that are used generally to uh, show an ablative of respect. And the first one is the word nomen in the ablative case. So nomine. Okay, and so if you see nomine, oftentimes it's an ablative of respect. So it just means in name. That is in respect to the person's name. I'll give you an example. Um, okay, so est weir nomine Marcus. Um, there is a man. Uh, named Marcus. That is, he's Marcus in respect to his name. So nomine is a really common word that sets off an ablative of respect. Uh, another example of an ablative of respect is with the verb supero. Uh, uh, to overcome or surpass. Um, sometimes the verb winko is used like this, super own winko or synonyms. Uh, winko meaning to conquer. Uh, so here is an example of uh, supero, or an ablative of respect using supero. Okay, so Scipio alios do case where tute superat. Uh, so Scipio superat surpasses uh, the other leaders alios do case. In virtue or in courage, that is, in respect to courage. Okay, so he does this in respect to courage, um, and that's henceforth why it's called the habit of respect. Okay, I'll give you one more example of this. Um, Okay, so again, we're using the verb supero uh, and an ablative for ablative of respect. So Marcus uh, supera bit will uh, overcome or will surpass all of his friends sapientia in 
wisdom. That is in respect to wisdom. So sapientia is our ablative of respect or specification we can call it, but respect I think is probably the more common term. Okay, and that's it for this uh, short talk on the ablative of respect, and uh, next time we'll be talking about dative of reference.